Hey guys, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a cute kawaii, well, DIY. So technically, it's going to be a donut notebook, but you can use whatever one you want. So first, what you're going to need a stapler, white paper, of course, a pencil, and scissors. So first, you want to take your pencil and draw out a big circle. You can use it as big as you want it to be. I tried my best to make a perfect circle. So then you want to do your, um, you know, like the design on the thing. And for mine, it's a donut. Alright, so I tried my best for the donut, as you can see here. Then you want to cut it out. And boop. Ah, um... Let's retry that. That's better. So then you want to take your donut and start to paint it. I am going to be using these Prisma color markers that I got for Christmas. And then you just start to color them. So then you want to, you want to get your color. I'm going to be using this brown. If it can focus. Yep. Perfect for the um, donut. Okay, so I actually came up with this. It's not the best, but I mean, it could be worse, right? <laughs> okay, so next I'm going to be using this rose pink for the frosting. Let's, let's do this. Okay, so, okay, so it didn't turn out as good as I expected it to be, but, you know, it's, um, it doesn't look good until we add a face and sprinkles, right? Let's do this. Alright, so I added the red sprinkles, and now, time for, you know, blue, I guess, or green. Alright, green sprinkles, done. Alright, I just added some, um, violet blue. It actually looks pretty good. And then the yellow. Sprinkles, done. Now for the cute kawaii face. Yay, favorite part. Time to ruin my bottom eraser. I'm using my bottom eraser to get some of the black paint to make a perfect circle. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm not good at that. So, boom. Just put a little eyes. It might take a while, but... You know. All right, so you're gonna let it dry and clean off the bottom of your eraser. Then again, you wanna use the black and put some on the tip your pencil. I find this this little hack really um easy to like draw little things. Also you have to keep dipping it in paint which might be a problem to some of you but But, I mean, what can you do? Maybe cute little face. And we're not done yet. It might look like a creepy stalker, but we're not done yet. You're not done without the blush, are you? No, you're not. So, technically, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to um, take the end of my eraser again, but only dip, like, half of it. As you can see. Half of it, just to make this the cute little see, and then dip it again, and then boom, it's a little blushing, you know, thing. Yeah, um, donut. And technically, you wanna let it dry. Okay, I waited about like ten minutes, and still aren't dry, but I'm just going to move on. 
do like the little eye pupils. Okay, so then you want to take your white paint. Mine's like almost finished, so we're not going to be using a lot. Alright, so you want to take like the end of your pencil again and just magically do that. And just, just get some white and just draw on your little pupils. As you can see. Okay, as you can see, it looks so cute and adorable. Yeah. Then you want to take your little donut here and place it on some paper and stencil it so you get the pages. I'll be right back and I'll do this. So, yeah. I want to trace it. I just made one. And hopefully you can see that on camera. Um, I just made one. And I'm going to get tons of other pieces of paper. Stack it under this and cut out. And hopefully make it bright. Let's, let's do this. As you can see, I have all this done. I only have five, but I'm going to be doing some more. So let's do that. Alright, as you can see, I'm cutting some more. Alright, so I have at least ten little pieces of paper. You can have more. I just have ten. And what you want to do is, so first you want to clean up all this, because I trimmed the edges a little bit, and you want to like put your little thing on it, and clean up all this mess. Okay, so it's on clean, I wiped it down, and then you want to take your cute little donut, use for the staple, make sure everything is how you want it, and all right. Like Oh, uh, like this, and you want to, I'm going to staple the side just so I can open it sideways. So, uh, again, make sure everything is all good. And please do not judge the first DIY I have made a long time. So, yeah, I'm going to staple it right there. I've been watching some other DIYs for inspiration. And you want to, I can't, I can't staple. You just staple it, and then there you go. You have a cute little, nope, actual working tiny little notebook, book, whatever you call it. <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, my stapler wasn't actually working, so then I had to get a new stapler. And then I, then it was nighttime when I actually fixed it. So, this is the next day, and this is my final thing. This is what it looks like. I am actually really proud, because this is my first DIY. Well, it's not really a DIY, it's more like a crafting session. So, yeah, that's the end of this video. So, yeah, see you later. Bye!